Back now with an update to our breaking news. A car crash on the city's east side. Major developments about an Amber Alert issued in the city of Cleveland as well. A silver Saturn view matching the description of a car involved in an Amber Alert. It just crashed. The child has been found. You can see Emily Hamilton live with what's been going on. Emily. Rob, yeah, most importantly, as you just mentioned, we are just told by police that 12 year old Kenyatta Knowles has been located. He's at home safe with his family. We just got word of that from police. But as you can see behind me, still a very active scene. We've been asked to stay uh, far down the street here on East 133rd Street. But this is where a car matching the description of that stolen vehicle has crashed into a yard here again. We are near East 133rd Street and Lambert. Uh, that is more than 15 miles from where that car was originally reported stolen. That scene uh, all was taking place earlier this afternoon, just a little after three o'clock near 46th and Clark. And so uh, that police were led here to this location again, uh, more than 15 miles away from where that car was originally reported stolen. The car, uh, you can see badly damaged up, up in this yard uh, over on the city's east side. Now, we did speak uh, with uh, someone who says she is that boy's mother earlier this afternoon. She was obviously very frantic, and there's still um, a lot of details that we're not yet sure of. We did see two people placed in handcuffs and taken into custody by Cleveland police just a few minutes ago and we'll continue to keep you updated on the very latest here from the east side. But again, as Rob mentioned, most importantly, that 12 year old boy Kenyatta Knowles has been found safe and he is at home with family reporting live on the east side. Emily Hamilton, News 5.